Hi everyone. In this video of algebraic identities, we are going to take up our second type of question related to identity 5. It says by using identity 5, evaluate the following. So let's start with the first question. 206 into 205. Now over here, 206 can be written as 200 plus 6 and 205 can be written as 200 plus 5. Now here, let's substitute x is equal to 200, a is equal to 6 and b is equal to 5 in our identity 5. So we'll get 200 whole square plus 6 plus 5 in bracket into 200 plus 6 into 5. Further, we will solve, we'll get 40,000 plus 6 plus 5 will become 11, 11 into 200 plus 30 and further we will solve and we'll get the answer 42,230. Now we shall move to second question. It has given 87 into 85 which is equal to we can write 90 minus 3 into 90 minus 5. Now over here minus sign we'll take inside. So we will write 90 plus in bracket minus 3 into 90 plus in bracket minus 5. Now over here, if you observe, x is equal to 90, a is equal to minus 3 and b is equal to minus 5. So we shall substitute these values in our identity 5 and we will get 90 whole square plus minus 3 minus 5 into 90 plus minus 3 into minus 5. Further, we will solve and we will get 8100. Now minus 3 and minus 5 will become minus 8 and into 90 and minus 3 into minus 5 will become plus 15. So together we will solve it and we'll get 7395. Now let's start third question 104 into 95. Now 104 can be written 100 plus 4 and 95 can be written as 100 minus 5. Now again minus sign we will take inside and we will write it in this form. 100 plus 4 into 100 plus in bracket minus 5. Now over here x is equal to 100, a is equal to 4, b is equal to minus 5. We shall substitute these values in our identity 5 and we shall get 100 whole square plus 4 minus 5 into 100 plus 4 into minus 5. Further we will solve, we will get 10,000. Now over here 4 minus 5, so we will get minus 1. Minus 1 in 200. Now over here next 4 into minus 5 is given. So 4 into minus 5 is minus 20. Now further we will solve all this and we will get 9880. Now we shall move to fourth question. 203 into 198. Now 203 can be written 200 plus 3 and 198 can be written as 200 minus 2 which is equal to 200 plus 3 into 200 plus in bracket we have taken minus sign inside so minus 2. Now over here x is equal to 200, a is equal to 3, b is equal to minus 2. We shall substitute these values in our identity 5 now and we will get 200 whole square plus in bracket 3 minus 2 into 200 plus 3 into minus 2. Now further we will solve, we will get 40,000. Now 3 minus 2 is 1. 1 into 200 is 200. And 3 into minus 2 is minus 6. Further we will solve all, all this and we will get 40,194. Now let's move to question number 5. It's given 35 into 37. Now 35 can be written as 40 minus 5 and 37 can be written as 40 minus 3. Now we shall take minus sign inside the brackets. So we shall write 40 plus in bracket minus 5 into 40 plus in bracket minus 3. Now over here x is equal to 40, a is equal to minus 5 and b is equal to minus 3. We shall substitute these values in our identity 5 and we will get 40 whole square plus minus 5 and minus 3 in bracket into 40 plus minus 5 into minus 3. Now 40 square is 1600. 
minus 5 and minus 3 is minus 8. So minus 8 into 40. Minus 5 into minus 3 is plus 15. So together we will solve this and we'll get 1295. Now let us move to question number 6. 106 into 93. Now 106 can be written 100 plus 6. 93 can be written as 100 minus 7. So over here we shall take minus sign inside the bracket and we will write 100 plus 6 and 100 plus in bracket minus 7. Now over here x is equal to 100, a is equal to 6, b is equal to minus 7. We shall substitute these values in our identity 5 and we will get 100 whole square plus in bracket 6 minus 7 into 100 plus 6 into minus 7. Now 100 square is 10,000. 6 minus 7 is minus 1. Minus 1 into 100 and 6 into minus 7 is minus 42. Further we will solve it and we will get 9858. So this is how we have solved our second type of questions related to identity 5. Thank you.